Tony Lewis, singer and bassist for The Outfield, has died. He was 62. I'm John Bowden. This is Rocky Street Music. On his official Twitter page, it read, It is with great sadness and sorrow to announce that Tony Lewis has unexpectedly passed away. He was a beautiful soul who touched so many lives with his love, his spirit, and his music. He loved his fans dearly and enjoyed every opportunity he had when meeting all of you. The band formed in 1984, and by the following year, all of us knew their songs, well, at least a lot of us. Your love was etched on the radio. It had kind of an 80s feel to it, but it had the soaring vocals, I remember thinking, of Boston. Brad Delp of Boston. The band's lineup back then was guitarist John Spinks, Tony as the vocalist and bassist, and Alan Jackman was their drummer. And their debut album, Play Deep, went three times platinum. They were an interesting British band where they had success everywhere but England. They had two hit singles from that debut album. After Your Love, it was All the Love in the World. Your Love reached number six. It's follow-up number 19. Bangin' was their second album. They had a minor hit with Since You've Been Gone. The follow-up Voices of Babylon also had a hit, number 25, with Voices of Babylon. And the following album, Diamond Days, had the hit single For You. Someone emailed me on Facebook today and said, Hey, that one-hit wonder band, Outfield, one of their guys died. And I went, well, A, they weren't a one-hit wonder band. And having an album go three times platinum for their debut says a lot. I mean, I wore that cassette out. All three guys in the outfield played together before outfield as a band called Serious B. They were a power pop band, which was pretty much what the outfield was. Then something started to change. The punk scene, that like I used to call it power punk, the tight drums, the speed of the songs was influencing their sound. They came back as the Baseball Boys. We should point out that John Spinks passed away in 2014. Tony Lewis, though, what a voice, huh? A distinctive voice, and like I thought, if you were going to mix a little bit of punk in that 80s power pop feel, and even a sprinkle of Brad Delp of Boston in there because of the layered voices, you'd have the outfield. There's been two today, Spencer Davis, we found out this morning, and now Tony Lewis, may he rest in peace. Any memories, did you know, Tony? Ever see them in concert, buy that debut album, or all any of the others? Share your memories. It's the day to do it. Make sure you comment on our video, subscribe to our channel, and share our videos. I'm John Bowden. Take good care of yourself.